When we're looking for a buffer, we're looking for a weak acid, weak base, conjugate pair. The weak acid and base might be hiding in a salt, might not be, um, it doesn't matter. So take every single thing you're given and first decide, is it an acid, base, or salt? Um, KCN is a salt, so I need to dissociate it to see what weak acid or base might be hiding in it. HCN is a weak acid, so I don't need to do anything with it. It turns out actually, since HCN is a weak acid, CN minus is its conjugate weak base. They're a conjugate pair, they're different only by one hydrogen, and they're both weak, neither of them are strong. So yes, this would make a buffer system. When we go here, both of these are salts, so I'll have to dissociate both of them in order to see if I have that conjugate pair I'm looking for. Na2SO4 will split, and NaHSO4 will split. Now, this is on your weak base chart. This is on your weak base and your weak acid. Frankly, it doesn't matter. I don't even know that I'd look at the chart. I know neither of them are strong. I also know they're different by just one H. So, the one with the extra H is my weak acid. The other one is my weak base. I can use the chart to confirm, but I don't need to. Um, so yes, this is also a buffer. When I go to this one, NH3 is a weak base. No need to dissociate it looking for a weak base. I already have a weak base. But this is a salt, so I will want to dissociate it to see if I have the conjugate weak acid that I need. Well, the conjugate weak acid I need is going to be NH4. So if you're not sure how to split this one up, know we're looking for NH4, which you know is a positive ion. NO3 is a negative ion. That is also a reasonable way to dissociate this because those are both poly polyatomics we know. That then gives me my weak acid, conjugates. Yes, we have a buffer. Um, NAI is a salt, so I could dissociate it, but I'm not going to bother because right away I see that this is a strong acid. In order to have a buffer, I need a weak acid and a weak base. Strong acid means this is not a buffer because oops, HI is strong. Another reason you might end up with something that's not a buffer is if the weak acid and weak base you do have aren't conjugate pairs, meaning they're different by more than one hydrogen. For instance,